Hello, guys. Good here. <laughs> nah, it's just Vex. Hi, guys. Welcome back to some more Minecraft. I was trying to uh, impersonate Good. He he has a way of when he says hello. It's like, hello, hello, guys. Hello, hello, guys. <laughs> I can't. I don't think I can do it right. Uh, but welcome back to some more Minecraft. All right. So this is the first episode I'm filming by myself, although Nebris, Cheaty Cheaty Nebris, is here on the server with me, and he said hi, and I said hi. Uh, so I get to talk about some stuff, and in, in relative peace and quiet, I suppose. But before I talk about stuff, let's go take a look around the spawn town. So, I filmed my session uh, yesterday at noon, and it's noon again today the next day so this is basically 20 about 23 hours i would say exactly uh roughly exactly who knows uh, but basically 20 23 22 hours let's see what we got done looks like the royal this is what i like to see over here is uh food for days dawning uh right here we have royal chicken BTC wasted no time uh, getting this set up. And I think that is amazing how fast he got that set up. Uh, looks like we do have an enchanting station. Uh, I've noticed there's chests all over the place that have no touchy thingies on them for no touchy. And looks like we do have an anvil enchanting table. Off camera I did enchant uh, my chest plate here in the pants and I just did basic enchantments on them. Uh, looks like the plaza is still a work in progress, although it's been more fleshed out. Uh, and the roads have been started in the cardinal directions here. I'm not sure who. If I had to take a guess, it would probably be Seth Bling, since he was also uh, excited about getting these basic four cardinal directions going. And, oh my lord, what is that over there? Uh, we have... Looks like here we have community animal pins, which have already been stocked up. I figured it would take a long time, but I guess if you have everybody on the server chipping in when they log on, you can get this done pretty quick, which is cool. Uh, there's the pigs down there. Oh, okay. Um, oh, and here are the creepy bunnies over here. Little creepy things. Look at them. Look at them. God, they don't even have any eyes. God, they're creepy. And, uh, looks like we still have some staircases down here. I think this is still Good's house. Uh, if this can even be called a house, but... Is this Good's stuff down here? So you put up a sign? Eggs? I don't... Uh... A lot of coal. No, this is probably community stuff, too. Okay. Um... Let's go back up here. And then it looks like we have something built over there. Uh, more community farms here. Probably still just temporary stuff until we can get uh, more detailed things set up. Uh, more farms over... Yeah. Looking good. Oh, cactus. Lovely. Uh, let me jump up here. Make sure I don't mess up the plants. Yeah, okay. I don't see pumpkins yet, though. Let me hop off. I uh, don't quite see any pumpkins yet. But I know we have pumpkins around here, I think. I heard somebody mention it. Looking nice, okay. Uh, and then over here is a tree farm. We don't really need... Oh, there's a build that's been started over there. Uh, and looks like we're going to... I think what we're going to do is we're going to make the road out of a mixture of uh, andesite, smooth stone, and cobblestone. I was personally just going to use uh, cobble... I don't like the gravel... And Endermen are going to grief this, too. I don't like the gravel. But I like the andesite, and I like the cobble together. Uh, but whatever, I guess the, the gravel's eventually going to form potholes as the Endermen grief it. <clears throat> okay, so what is this over here? This is new. Nebris. Alright, so Nebris has made something. Is he over here? What's that? Maybe a well? Looks like you know, it's going to be a house or a manor of some kind. He's already got clay down? Wow. Well, he is a cheater. We have established that. It looks like he's already making a stone castle or of some kind. 
Uh, anybody see a name tag around? Oh yeah, he. Oh, he's down mining then. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna bug him then if he's mining. Uh, and I have my own stuff to do. Anyway. And what is this over here? Now UHC mode's not turned on. Thankfully, I'm supportive of that. I. It just kind of made that. Uh, I know who this is. I don't need to be told who this is. This is a flim flammer here that lives here. Oh my gosh. Now that's just asking to be pranked by having his RV uh, deconstructed and then rebuilt to appear as if it had crashed into the ravine. Uh, that's That's got to be Jenny's RV. <laughs> okay, organic slime ranch, okay. Makes me think, uh, slime, huh? Kind of makes me think that some, some of these guys have uh, looked through the seed, maybe with uh, loading it up, loading the seed up and then peeking at it in MC Edit or some other program. Is that a pumpkin? No, no, that's just a sign. What what does it say? I gotta go look. I can't leave a, a, a sign. Oh, nuts. I got a zombie on me. I wanna go see. What does this say? Whose sign is this and what's, what's gonna be built here? Lake Zell, please don't build in or right next to it. Thanks. Okay, so he's claimed a, a lake. Uh, Anders, you already got... Uh, Jenny's already built next to it. Sorry, buddy. There's a gold object over there. A golden uh, tower with two blocks at the base. Uh, <coughs> no idea what that could be. Could be anything, guys. No idea uh, what that object is. No idea. Uh, okay. Well, I've got my own stuff to do. I need to get... All right. Priority one is I need to fix my kit. I don't have... I don't have a... Do I have a bow? I don't have a bow. I don't have a bow. I don't have a sword. It broke. Um, it was. It, I felt it, it was very chaotic when we were playing uh, all together. It was just kind of hectic. Uh, but I can... Well, I do that, I already see glowstone. Man, these guys don't waste any time. I almost wish they played a little slower. Because it's like these guys get on and they just play all day long. And they just do a bunch of stuff. And I feel like other players, myself included, get, get left behind, I guess. Uh, I don't know why I keep picking up these, these eggs here. Maybe if I wanted an XP farm. I don't know. Oh my gosh, that's, that's way too many eggs. I don't need all these. There needs to be a chest here to store them. Let me do that real quick. Anyway, while I um, do some piddly stuff, I can talk about what I want to do this season. Uh, obviously, oh my god, the sheep. Uh, obviously, I want to make the roads, because I kind of volunteered for that. Uh, let me do... That's a little bit better. I don't have a sword. Well, that'll have to do. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Ah, nuts. Alright, we need an egg chest. Uh, and I have signs on me, right? No, I don't have signs. I must have unloaded them. So first priorities is going to be the road. I also need to set up a temporary uh, like some sort of temporary base where I can unload. There we go. Uh, I can unload. Oh, wait a minute. Was that a personal chest? Oh, dang it. Well, I just need one sign. I, I'm sure he won't care. Uh, and then after that, I, I need I kind of have an idea for a build. Um, it's basically like a a, a Hogan's Alley or a uh, practice range uh, for bows. I want to use because I was going to make a bow shop, right? I was going to make a, a bow shop with a firing range in Season 4, but I didn't have time for it. And I think it would be a cool community build and it would be something players could do together. I bet BTC would like it. He seems like he would like that kind of thing. Uh, and I want to use, like, pistons to have targets pop up, you know? And when you go through it, you got to go through it, and maybe one player can keep time. Uh, what is it? What are they called? A shoot house? 
Is that what they're called? Shoot house, I think. Uh, if you ever played uh, Modern Warfare, the first game, uh, the game starts off in training where you're doing one of those. Uh, but yeah, that's basically what I'd like to make as my first uh, first significant... Oh my gosh, I keep getting... Eggs. Way too many eggs. Uh, as my first significant build. So, uh, how am I going to run this season compared to last season? Uh, I'd like to apologize for last season towards the end. It feels like uh, I got... I fell into the trap of always thinking that I needed to make... I didn't want to... Ooh, I placed it. I didn't mean to do that. Of always having to do bigger and better builds. And I noticed, like, I wasn't uh, releasing as many episodes as I should have been. Uh, I, I guess I fell into that trap of thinking, like, I gotta always just show off uh, fresh eggs. Stock them. Take them. Okay of having to make bigger and better builds and th those take, you know, more time to do and you guys really wouldn't want to see too much uh, just building and piddling around on them. Uh, you just would want to see like the finished products, but I don't think that's the case. I think a lot of fun stuff happens during those moments in Minecraft when you're just messing around and I shouldn't shy away from that kind of stuff. So hopefully this season I can uh, make a lot more episodes for you guys. I like this fence here. It makes me feel very safe. Hi, zombies. Is there a path? Where's the path? I really need to make myself a sword, don't I? Can I do a, go ahead and make a sword real quick? I've got one steak and no cobblestone. Well, that's unfortunate. But I think one of the first things I need to do is I need to get some sort of hut or something set up. Uh, or I can have a personal chest, and then, um, let's see, let's grab half a stack of wood. Actually, these are my planks I stuck in here earlier. Am I safe? Gotta look around. It's not lit up yet, obviously, so I'm vulnerable to attack here. Let's hop back in here. Let's make some signs so I don't have to borrow some from Etho. Here's your sign back, buddy. Alright. Uh, first up, we need some self-protection. Uh, let's get that on my bar. Oh, it's like starting Minecraft all over again. That's... Well, yeah, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> it's ex starting Minecraft over. Uh, so let's see. Uh, shelter storage, little storage area for myself of some kind. I guess I could hang out in here. Yeah, let's say, let's just hang out in here. Uh, let's snuggle up beside uh, Vex's bed. Snuggle with me and Derps. <laughs> He'll like that. Uh, Anders is a really fun guy. I really like him. He has a penchant for saying, like, borderline humor sometimes, though. Uh, which maybe might be offensive to some viewers. But, eh. I still love the guy. Um, let's see. Yeah. Axe. Sword. That's right. No, that's where my bow is supposed to be. Uh, I need a bow. There's not one in the community chest, is there? Safe? For, oh, wait a minute. Let me just... Oh, dang it. Hey, get out of here. Get out. Out. I'm not welcome here. Is that the only one? Or are there more? Anybody see any? Okay, I think we're safe. Yeah, we're safe. Seems okay. No, I want to set my spawn. No. Let me sleep. Are you kidding me? Oh no. Where are they? Oh, that's about to be daytime. Time. <laughs> um does anybody see the the monster that's causing this? Cuz I don't. I must be blind. Oh. 
but this uh, this season of uh, Minecraft, I don't think I'm going to do giant builds anymore. That seems like something a single player world would be a lot better for. Uh, and and really, I think it's against the, maybe against the spirit of what we're trying to do with this season of uh, of Minecraft, focusing more on community oriented stuff. And let's be honest, running off by yourself into the wilderness to your own base that's isolated from other people and then doing some build uh, like for example myself or uh, Zisto likes to do I mean that's not really like why bother doing that on a server when it's out in the middle of nowhere uh, you should just do that on single player I guess um, so if you're gonna play on a multiplayer server like this you should do more stuff with multiplayer and collab so that there's actually a point to being on a server. And the sheep is annoying me by being in here, so he gets to die. Uh, so that's, that's one thing. That's one difference between uh, this season and last season. Um, now some other people might do giant builds. Uh, I don't know. I, I mean, my, my shooting house firing... Uh, I need to... Hold on. Be right back. Okay, I was right. I just checked Wikipedia. It, it's called a shoot house, or sometimes known as a either a shoot house or a kill house. Kill house sounds so scary and mean. Uh, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna call it a shoot house. That's the proper term. So yeah, my shoot house might end up being kind of big, but hopefully that's something that uh, people can get together and play at and have fun, and you know be sociable. You know, get the get the guys together. And Relly. Although, let's be honest, Relly's one of the guys. Uh, she's a great friend. Yes, she's a friend. Sorry, shippers. And the ship sinks. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, the iceberg that's called friendship. Um, I, think, I, think, I think it is kind of funny that any time I do a any kind of video... Or honestly, even like hang out with a uh, a female, uh, we start getting people start shipping us. I don't. Uh, it doesn't bother me at all. It doesn't bother me at all. In fact, I I like to give the nod to the the ship community. Um, Does I mean it's cool, you know? People taking an interest in you and talking about you. Um, I'll never begrudge anybody for that. Uh, so we 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 have fun. Relly Relly and I poke at the uh, like to poke at the the ship community. Um, I don't think Zisto does. I, I get the vibe that he's not really into it at all. Uh, maybe it even kind of creeps him out. I'm not really sure. Uh, that's just the vibe I get from him that he's not really into it. Uh, yeah, okay. I need a sword. I need a bow. What's the best way to get a bow? Oh, I, oh I'm such a derp. I, I forgot. I was trying to check the community chest. Uh, things Vex is good at. Uh, being a derp. Rambling. Getting sidetracked and distracted. And maybe somewhere way down on the list uh, might be map making. I don't know. I feel like I'm not allowed to say that. Uh, at all. Oh, there's... Is that my bow? Because I did... I could have sworn I had a bow. There's another bow. They're just power ones. I guess I'll take one, because this is a community chest. Anybody see any arrows? I've got eight on me. Man, I, you really miss infinity bows. They're such a good way of dealing with monsters. I've got chicken on me. I don't really need the raw mutton. Uh... But yeah, let's stay in the uh, community hut for now. I also need a, uh, a chest here. Yeah? Uh, probably should make it a double chest, I guess. And I've got a sign right here. Right there for it. And put that away. Um, Settling's private chest. Uh, Vex's chest. <laughs> okay, 
Let's unload everything. Ah, oh, that feels so good to unload my inventory finally. Ah, oh, yes, yes, yes. Ah, oh, so cluttered. I gotta be honest, that was giving me a little bit of anxiety. Having my inventory cluttered. I think I have like a, a neat freak streak in me. Like... I wouldn't, I wouldn't say I'm seriously OCD, because uh, that might, you know, I don't want to belittle or make light of serious cases of OCD, but I, I could totally see myself having some of those tendencies. Uh, like when we were making the road, like I really just wanted the road to go straight. And I know it's completely irrational to be bothered by the fact that it hugs the terrain. But I just... I really, just uh, go straight, straight. Like, I don't know. I like that for some reason. And it, it it's completely irrational for me to be like that, but I am. But uh, I know this about myself, and that's fine. That is good. Okay. So we have... Uh, no, I, and I can't sleep now, because it's... Let's see here. So there, I don't like the I don't like these, the color of the stuff. I don't like it. I'll have to keep my iron with me. Food, ender pearl. If I get an emergency and I might want to jump out. Uh, coal. Uh, what else? Arrows. Arrows. Um. Okay. And maybe some cobblestone. I think I should use mostly, uh, maybe mostly stone picks for a bit, and ease up on chugging down so much iron because iron is limited supply for us uh, but yeah uh, I guess I should I should probably sign off and uh, maybe off camera well I've already got my inventory pretty much sorted out so next episode we're ready to do something uh, I'm not sure what to do first maybe I should go caving and try and get myself some diamond picks going uh, that'd be pretty cool and I'm really thinking maybe Diamond picks, and that's it. No diamond armor, no diamond swords, or any other diamond tools, but save the diamonds just for picks. Uh, that's my thinking there. Well, maybe a diamond sword, because let's be honest, a diamond sword does last a long time. Uh, most importantly, though, I want a bow. I really want to focus on a bow. I need to find a skeleton spawner and just live at that skeleton spawner for a week. That's, real, that's what I need to do. Uh... Oh yeah, maybe that could be something like I can explore it and adventure around until I find a skeleton spawner. Oh, that would be wonderful. Uh, yeah, yeah, I might, I might do that because we got this road here for me to work on. That's my project. It's another so the road, uh, a shoot house, and but I, I want to kind of want to say my first priority should be caving and then a, a skeleton spawner. Because uh, I could write a, a short book on how just how good a bow is in Minecraft. Because it's renewable, easily repairable, it's cheap. Uh, I mean, a skeleton spawner will provide you with infinitely repairable and re renewable uh, weaponry. That's better than a sword in a lot of ways, because it's ranged and you don't need to get close to stuff. And, uh, and a bow... Even a bow without unbreaking, a bow without unbreaking has a lot of use. 384 shots. Uh, that's a lot of mileage. That's a lot of dead monsters. Uh, with a little bit of unbreaking on it, though, it gets a lot better. So, I'd like to recreate uh, Kaya no Mai from Season 4. That I think that's one of my first things I want to get done. Well, anyway, thank you for listening uh, to me brainstorm and talk out uh, my priorities here. I need to, you know what I really need to do to keep me organized since I'm apparently a little on the scatterbrained side? Uh, do I have some signs in here? Well, I can make some real quick. Uh, let's see. And this would be cool, actually, just, you know, access to do list. Access to do list. Uh, okay, one skelly spawner, two road, that's three. 
Com build. Now, oh. shoot house. Commune build. There we go. All right, uh, Skelly spawner, roads, and the shoot house. Yes, that's what I'm going to work on. All right, cool. Thank you guys very much for watching me. I'm going to sign off, and I'll see you guys next video. Until then, take care. Oh, 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 um, I'm not doing intros this season. Uh, let me know what you think if you missed the intro or not. I, I figured I'd just cut right into, you know, the actual video. Because, I mean, it's like a 10-second intro per every episode. I mean, that probably adds up to, like... 10 seconds, so every six episodes is just a minute of your life spent watching the intro. Six minutes. Yeah, I, I don't want to... Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, so I, I'm not doing the intro this season. I'm just letting it go right into the episodes. I think I like that better. Personally, personally for me, uh, like, on well, my series that I regularly watch, like, uh, like Zero Punctuation, or angry video game nerd. Uh, I just I always skip the intros because I just want to get right into the, the stuff I want to watch. So uh, no intro this season. Anyway, uh, thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Until then, take it easy.